Catherine's upcoming return to Balmoral evokes a whirlwind of emotions, as she fondly remembers the late Queen Elizabeth II. The Balmoral, the picturesque Scottish royal estate, holds deep sentimental value for Catherine and William, evoking emotions, as they remember the beloved monarch who is no longer with them. Catherine first visited Balmoral Castle in 2009, two years before her wedding to Prince William. On Catherine's first visit to Balmoral, Her Late Majesty the Queen broke protocol and let her bring her camera, as she knew Catherine loved photography. Queen Elizabeth reportedly allowed the Princess of Wales to take photos during her first visit to Balmoral. Catherine, the Princess of Wales, has had a remarkably warm and sweet relationship with Queen Elizabeth II since joining the royal family. From the moment she became a part of the Windsor clan, Catherine has displayed grace, poise, and an unwavering commitment to her royal duties, endearing herself to both the British public and the Queen. Queen Elizabeth acting as a mentor to Catherine, providing invaluable guidance and support, as she navigated the complexities of royal life. For Catherine, returning to Balmoral without the presence of Queen Elizabeth brings a mixture of emotions. While the estate's beauty and serenity remain unchanged, there is a sense of loss and nostalgia, as they fondly remember the late Queen's vibrant presence during previous visits. The memories of her laughter, wisdom, and kindness continue to resonate, leaving an indelible mark on the princess's heart. Family traditions are very meaningful for the royal family, and it has become a family tradition for the Prince and Princess of Wales to head to Scotland each summer. Along with their children Prince George, 9, Princess Charlotte, 7 and Prince Louis, 4, they would spend time with the late Queen on her annual holiday at the Balmoral Estate. Of course, Prince William has been visiting the Scottish Highlands retreat ever since he was a small boy with the rest of his royal relatives. One very famous photo Catherine took at Balmoral was released last year following the sad death of Prince Philip. It showed the late Queen and the late Prince of Edinburgh, in 2018, surrounded by seven of their great-grandchildren, during one of their family holidays in Scotland. Queen Elizabeth would stay at Balmoral throughout August and into September. Throughout her stay, the late Queen would invite family members to stay with her and they take part in a range of outdoor pursuits. The royals are said to love going on walks around the estate's 50,000 acres, as well as enjoying picnics and barbecues. As the summer sojourn to Balmoral approaches, Catherine looks forward to immersing her family in the natural beauty of the estate, engaging in activities they hold dear, such as hiking, horse riding, and scenic picnics. The trip offers an opportunity for the Wales family to strengthen their bonds and create cherished memories together, while also honouring the legacy of the late Queen.